Okay, we're looking at 4.1.23, and I went ahead and derived the geometric sequence, uh, the sum of geometric sequence. And uh, so first thing you do is A1 through AN is the sequence. That's, uh, remember, R is the uh, ratio, and A1 is the starting point. And notice that AN is equal to A1 times R to the N minus 1. So then what we do is add them all together to get the summation, and then we also multiply that sum by r. Then notice that they, these are both infinite, so if we subtract them, we get something that's finite. So uh, this minus nothing is a1, and then all of these cancel out. That one minus that, zero, zero, zero. All these are zero. And then finally, when you take this uh, minus this, you get that negative number there. So um, this minus a1 minus nothing is a1. And finally, nothing minus a1 r to the n is negative a1 r to the n. OK, so then we just factor out an sn. And it's right there. What we're left with is a 1 minus r. And then uh, we're factoring out an a1. What we're left is 1 minus r to the n. And then we get the summation formula. It's right here. So then what we can do is uh, find n. And I couldn't think of a better way than to just do this. So if you look here, a n is just a1 r to the n minus 1. And then um, we just solve for that n value just using standard pre-calculus stuff. So we find out n is 64. So we have the n, we have the a value, that's the starting point, which is one, and we have the ending point, which is a n. And, um, oh no, we actually didn't need the ending point. We needed r, which is the common ratio, which is times two every time. So times two every time. Okay, so then let's go over here. We've got, R, we've got R, we've got N is 64, we got A1 is 1. So fill that out, and we find out that we get this number here. And then from this point, I start um, using some techniques to try to reduce it down, and then I start using mod 11 to reduce it even further. For example, 16 is 5 in mod 11. And then I just continue this pattern and until you get 4. <laughs> so uh, 4 is the answer. Just keep using the, the, these techniques to end up with uh, the answer. And, and make sure to check it again. So these, these types of things with all these steps going on, especially all these steps here, you could get something wrong. So just make sure that you check it over. Um, Wolfram agrees with me, so does the back of the book. But yeah, that's about it.